Electrographics. In this paper, we introduce a method to apply ideas from electrostatics to computer graphics. We virtually charge the objects in the scene as conductors by running a charge simulation. Using the field lines and equipotential surfaces of the resulting electric field, we can define a body-centric coordinate system called electric coordinates, which parameterizes the outer space of the charged object in a way analogous to polar coordinates. The electric potential computed through charge simulation is a harmonic function, which cannot have local extrema except at the boundary. Here we show how the surface of the object is mapped to a sphere at infinity by the electric coordinates. This mapping can be applied to texture mapping and morphing objects that have different topology. Also, by using shape invariant properties of Gauss's law in integral form, we can compute a parameter called flux which quantifies the degree to which a character or an object is surrounded by another deformable object. The flux can be used as a reference to direct the movements of the deformable object to cover or uncover the surface of a charged object. The electrostatic parameters are convenient to synthesize scenes that involve close interactions of a deformable object and a rigid object. For example, we can easily design deformable objects such as fur and hair on the surface of a character without making them penetrate through each other. We can also grow plants such as grass in a way that they avoid charged obstacles. We can easily design clothes by specifying the area on the body that we want to cover and tracking the equipotential of a threshold value. We can also apply ideas of 2.5D layering to 3D surfaces by using the electric potential as the depth. Here we show examples of switching the layering order of the designed clothes. We can also transfer the designed clothes to other characters by computing the dense correspondence between the characters. Now we show some examples of controlling the deformable objects through the electrostatic parameters. Our method can be applied for wrapping convex as well as concave shapes of arbitrary topologies. The bag adapts to the shape of the object in order to wrap around it. This allows it to deal with changes in geometry, size and topology. Even when the bag starts from a folded configuration, the system can automatically unfold it and wrap it around the reference object. No global path planning is needed for synthesizing these movements. We can replace the bag with a fish model to create an animation of a fish eating prey. We can also apply the method to simulate simple dressing movements. In this animation, a character is controlled to put on a sock. The sock's opening is controlled in the electric coordinates of the body, such that it approaches the tip of the toes to start the wrapping process. In this example, a character successfully puts on pants. Thank you for watching.